Hey guys, so this is day two of Daily Dave. Someone asked me to post a different creature a day from my collection. So today we're going to be talking about Terrapine Carolina, the Eastern Box Turtle. Look at the colors on this boy. How cool is that? Look at the yellow. Let's get in and get a shot of the eyes. Look how red his eyes are. So the males have red eyes, typically, and the females, obviously, my female has decided to show you why they call them box turtles. They can just fold up just like a box, close up, and you can't even see them. Um, so fully protected. But that, that is a female, and a female typically have brown eyes. Also, if you'll notice on the bottom, I don't know if you can see it. See that angle? See how the bottom is curved on a male right in there, whereas a female has a flat bottom. So that's how you can differentiate between a male and a female. Uh, a little bit about the box turtle. It's the only fully terrestrial turtle found in North Carolina. It is the state reptile. I think it's the state reptile of Tennessee as well. Um, beautiful colorations. Uh, they, you'll see them in a, uh, you'll see different colors. It's rare to see one with this much yellow, but you'll see them with yellow and orange and uh, different patterns. Um, usually live around 25 years, 25 to 30 years. Uh, there are documented cases of box turtles that have lived to be over 100. Uh, conservation is really important with these guys. Right now they're listed as vulnerable, um, which is very close to being endangered. Um, they have a huge homing instinct, which means they, you can't take it from the area where they were born uh, because they will just try to get back there and most likely die. So if you see one, leave it where you find it um, because typically they, their range is very, very small. They only move about 75 yards a day, um, so less than a football field length. And they don't really roam much more than like a thousand feet from where, you know, their area, they're, they're, they're where they're born. Um, so, like I said, if you leave, if you see one, leave it. Um, they're omnivores, so they eat both plants and animals. They love insects and earthworms and all kinds of veggies. So, omnivores. Um, and I told you about conservation. So, one of the things that I do every year, I have a permit by the state of North Carolina to be able to keep these in captivity. Um, so, I breed them. And check this out. This is really cool. Look at that. I gotta get in. Can I get, oh yeah, I mean, come on. Does it get any cooler than that? This is a baby box turtle. And that's the mommy right there. And there's another baby box turtle. Look at the size difference. And most people never get to see baby box turtles in the wild. Look at that cute face. So it's very hard to ever spot one of these in the wild and these are less than a year old so they hatched out last fall so what about five or six months old um really cool though huh so anyway terrapine carolina the eastern box turtle we need to take care of these things they're unfortunately popular in the pet trade overseas so a lot of poachers come and take them from north carolina to be shipped overseas so again, if you see one, leave it where you found it. Until next time.